Well, a couple of things. I actually have a strong craft background. I sort of evolved into more different media. And, um, you know, that craft's history stays with me, even when I work in other media. I think about how things are done and what materials they're made of. And sometimes I get lost in the how things are done as much as what the product is. The whole point of the studio is that we can be creative with the glass much in the way that a painter is at that moment. And that's those options we entertain. Otherwise, other people would make it. What we made today as a team probably has never been made before. That was one a big thing. So we all sort of, I, even though I was more liable artistically for the show, they were very much a part of it. And sub subsequently, the ownership of what we did tonight is with all three of us. I think it's invigorating to be around people that are, that whose lives are moving forward. And not only as personally, but, but artistically, I find that really, really exciting. And, and their unestablishment is an establishment in itself and from the, my point of view in that what their commitment is as to what they do next. Hopefully the best work in yours and all of our lives is what we do next. There's historical associations within my lifetime in terms of what I first thought of Corning as a student, maybe 30 some years ago, I hate to use those numbers and what it is now, and then to sort of see what has changed, to have a permanent piece in the headquarters means a lot. So I've actually can see, it's, it's actually the first time I've actually looked at the piece aesthetically as opposed to looking at it technically, this trip. That was important to me. This whole thing of how it functions within that building and, and how art functions within this building and then how I function on this trip in a much more organic way is sort of all of it's an honor. It's a really a verification of who I am.